Hey, it's Paul from Guitar World, and now we're going to be looking at Epiphone's exciting new Ultra 2 Les Paul guitar. There's a lot to talk about this new innovative guitar from Epiphone in the Les Paul shape, and so let's get right to it and talk about it. From its appearance, it looks just like an Epiphone Les Paul, but cleverly hidden is innovative electronics and something new for Epiphone, which combines acoustic technology and electric guitar technology. And now you have a hybrid guitar that blends both acoustic sounds and electric guitar sounds into an Epiphone Les Paul. And it sounds really great. Let's take a look by looking where the pickup and the electronics are located on this guitar. Cleverly hidden right here on the fretboard, you can see what we have is Shadow Electronics, which Epiphone partnered with to, to provide the acoustic technology. We have their proprietary acoustic technology in the form of a nano mag. And as I said before, it's cleverly hidden in the fretboard. Now, if I flip the guitar over, you can see right where the electronics would normally be. We also have the electronics for the shadow pickup. And so you can see there's a treble knob and a bass knob and a gain knob, which allows you to tailor your acoustic sound. And of course, over here, we have a nine volt battery compartment to power that. Also, on this guitar, what I have set up is I have um, it set up in stereo operation. So this is a really cool feature. Basically, you can run the guitar in a mono mode just by removing this, and it'll act as a normal guitar. But of course, the electronics are still built in. It just takes a little more uh, dialing in of the tones, but I'll show you that a little bit later. But by combining two quarter-inch jacks in here, I can basically bounce between electric guitar sounds and acoustic guitar sounds simply by using a selector switch, which I have right down here on the floor, or I can use a combination of both sounds, which is a really nifty feature. Now, this guitar, I should also mention, is chambered, so it's really lightweight. The neck has got very much of a very slim 60s profile, and it's satin finished on the back, so it you can really get around on this guitar. High-end features such as Grover tuners complete the guitar. And we also have a pair of Alnico humbucking pickups. Let's explain how the electronics work with the standard Les Paul configuration of knobs. Over here, we still have the volume knob for the treble pickup, the rhythm knob for the rhythm pickup. Over here, we have the nano mag knob, which is the acoustic knob. It's a master knob over here, and then we have a master tone here. So if I'm running in a mono mode, and I just want to use the electric guitar pickups, I got to turn off the nano mag pickup. And if I just want to use the acoustic part of it, I got to turn off both pickups, depending on what, what um, pickup I'm selected, and then just use this as the vo overall volume control. And of course, this is just your standard master tone. Now, if I'm running as I have it here in in stereo mode, I don't have to worry. I can just switch this on and off and this on and off. So it's really neat. So it makes life a whole lot easier, if you, especially if you want to bounce between acoustic sounds and electric guitar sounds. A really great idea. So let's begin with hearing the acoustic sounds from this guitar. Now, I'm using a, an electric guitar amp, so I don't have it plugged into an acoustic amp. It would greatly uh, enhance the sound of this because it's a really great a sound a great acoustic sound out of this But I'll let you hear what it sounds like through an electric guitar amp, which is more than likely what you're going to be using it if you're playing live so Right now, uh, I'm just gonna be using this volume to do it and uh, you'll get to hear the acoustic sound here we go So as you just heard, it gets a really great acoustic guitar sound through an electric guitar amp. And uh, part of that is to dial in the proper sound you know, when you plug into your uh, electric guitar amp. So, so what you hear is a very soft acoustic guitar sound. Now I can dial it to get a little more aggressive. And simply by going in the back here, 
I'm going to turn up the gain, and you'll hear how fuzzy it gets when you turn it up. And then you can, and I'll move the bass and treble control so you can really hear, you know, how much the frequency changes. So here's with the gain turned up. And what's cool about that is that it almost acts as a ma master volume amp, kind of like if you want to combine that with the electric guitar, uh, with the regular electric guitar pickups, you kind of get a little bit of a more of a preamp distortion on top of it. So you can really dial in a great almost overdrive tone. So let me go back. What I did is I turned down the gain a bit. I'm going to roll off a lot of the bass and then I'm going to pull up the treble all the way and get a really uh, nice acoustic, another acoustic guitar sound. Let's hear that. So that has a little bit more cut to it. I'm going to dial that back, bring back the bass frequency in there, give it a little more body. Let's hear that. Now let's move over to the electric guitar side. And because I have it in, in a dual mode over here using two jacks, it's as simple as me hitting the switch over here on my um, selector switch. And now I'm in electric guitar mode. So as I said before, going between acoustic and electric sounds is as easy as hitting the switch on a selector box, and especially when you're using two jacks. Let me demonstrate that because it's really cool. Now the fun begins when you can combine both the electric guitar sounds and the acoustic sounds and blend them together. Let's begin by getting both of those sounds in the mix. So here I am with my acoustic sound and now I'm going to hit both on my selector switch. And now I got both. And what I can do is pull back the acoustic and get more of the electric guitar sound. Let's hear that. And slowly bring back the acoustic sound. or dial in less of the electric guitar sound. Or slowly bring it back. Now, as I said before, what I can do is I can turn up the gain on the back of this on the nano mag and really drive it. So this is where it gets fun. I'll turn up the treble and bass too. And uh, you'll get to hear how much of output I get. Now, I'm I have both, uh, I'm using both the electric and acoustic sound. So let's start with the electric, electric guitar sound 
and listen as I, as I drive and add more gain on top of it. Here we go. There are certainly a lot of hybrid acoustic electric guitars available on the market, but Epiphone has seemed to capture the essence of it by introducing this Ultra 2, which is an affordable and lightweight guitar and also great sounding, which is why it gets the Platinum Award. Definitely check it out.